Welcome to the video, my friends. Today, we're going to talk more about the Serpent's Moon event for Hunt Showdown, which went live on the 27th of July. For those who haven't seen my previous video, Serpent's Moon is Hunt Showdown's biggest event yet, with more rewards, blood bonds, and weapons available. Some of the new rewards are the new Sparks Pistol, the Romero 77 Alamo, a new trap called Miner's Song, and a unique evolving hunter, the Viper, which is granted to everyone at the beginning of the event. Throughout the event, you can earn event points to earn said rewards. To earn these points, you can destroy snake dens, loot snake dens, banish snakes on the altars found at certain locations, investigate event clues and rifts, killing bosses from looting player corpses, and extracting successfully with at least one bounty. Another way to gain some event points is by either using Mr. Chari's contracts or event traits like Signy. You can also use both at the same time and get a stackable point boost. Also, for the first time in Hunt, we have a new battle pass called the Gilded Path. Here, I have unlocked the premium pass to show you how to get started, but there is also a free and standard pass available. All three give you blood bond cashback and lots of rewards, as I mentioned before. The all-new story of Serpent's Moon follows on from the previous Traitor's Moon event. The story will unlock as you progress through the event. You can either read each chapter of the story or sit back and listen to the recorded voice acting provided, which I thought was a really nice touch. In all her glory was dying. Even those who knew nothing of the corruption could sense her decline. Serpent's Moon also introduces a variety of new game mechanics for you to play how you like, either loot a snake den with stealth, avoiding snake poisoning, or run in guns blazing and destroy dens while risking your location to other hunters. But if you manage to take out the hunters that come tracking you down, you can net yourself 12 points per hunter kill, as well as all snakes that that hunter was carrying. I'm actually pretty curious to know the most event points you've got in a single match. Let me know in the comment section below. I would also like to just mention that for newcomers interested in Hunt Showdown, there is currently a 50% sale running until the 8th of August. And for new and old hunters, there is a new DLC, The Prescient, and a bundle. They came from Salem. Both these DLCs can boost your event points if you use them during the event. I treated myself to the cool looking Prescient DLC to get those event point bonuses, plus the character does look pretty awesome. Also, as always, I would just like to add a full disclosure, these videos are in partnership with Crytek, but many of you will know I genuinely do love Hunt Showdown, and if you have been wanting to dive in for a while now might be a good time during the sale and new event. With all that said, I hope this video was of some help to you, and for now, I will leave you with some gameplay from Serpent's Moon. Thank you for watching, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe if you want to see more content, and leave a comment in the comment section below on your thoughts on Serpent's Moon. And most of all, I hope you enjoyed the video. Oh, do you hear that? Yep. That's a full damage. Don't know if we're getting past the hole in the wall front left. I'm going to try and push it up here. Hopefully without aggroing all these zombies. Right, right behind you. I'm going to go through the glass here and then up on the stairs. Snakes here, but we'll leave those for now. Play it. You got him. Yep. Looking across. We just pulled this uh, elevator across. Birds. Yep. I think that's where they was going to go. I'm not sure if there was... Uh... Could have been a solo player. Could be. Let's get up on the roof roof. See if we can get this uh, elevator up there. Yeah. Oh, coin. I'm gonna scare the crows, but we'll have the high ground, so. There's an altar there as well. 
down below. Oh my god, I knew the crows were there and they still scared me. Shots to the south, southwest. Cash register there. Where is he? I don't know. Oh, there he is. Oh, he's on me. Oh yeah, he likes you. I got a heal. Oh my god. Poisoned. Oh, Reloaded. Oh, hello. Oh, that's not good. Go back up the ladder to heal. I'm nearly dead. I'm going to scout around the compound, see if anybody's pushing us. Vanishing. Are you using dark sight? No. I got footsteps by me. Yeah, they're right by me. Right on me, mate. Coming. Right here. Right here. Right here. Oh. Whether that was trying to distract him while the other one runs around. I've called an the elevator down so we can just grab this and go up. Yep. Good show. There's a dead guy down there. He killed himself. Do you reckon? He threw a lot of grenades, didn't he? Don't see anyone. Yeah, he must have killed himself. <laughs> oh, let's go down and loot him. I need to use that altar there as well. Is there another body here? Yeah, there's another one. They killed themselves. Oh my god. Wow. And I come running to you like, I'm coming. And then they're just, they're already dead. They, they took one look at me and they're like, no, it's not worth it. Well, successful raid. Glad those guys took the easy way out. <laughs> <laughs>